Welcome back to another computer sluggish video. Have you subscribed to our YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button and click on the bell to get notified when we upload a new video. In today's video, I will be showing you a few things you can check to make sure it's not your PC that's causing the issues connecting to the Black Ops Cold War online services. You may be getting a notice window saying that it cannot connect to Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War online services or you may just have a constant loading bar saying that it's connecting to Call of Duty online services and just not doing anything. The first thing to make sure on your PC is that you are connected to the internet. And as you can see in the bottom right hand corner of my screen, I do have a connection to the internet. If I click onto my adapter, it says connected, which is all good. If I open up my web browser, I can go onto Google and just type in speed test and then click on run speed test. And straight away, I know I have a internet connection. As you can see, I'm getting about 60 meg a second, which is great. I can rule out that issue. Another thing you can do if you are using wireless is go ahead and plug your PC directly into your router as it might be your wireless that is causing you an issue. You may have a connection right now, but it might be that the connection is getting disconnected within seconds of you going into the game and then you minimize to your desktop and you haven't actually noticed that your connection has been lost because it's reconnected again. If you are plugged in directly with a cable, it might even be worth trying a different cable if you have one lying around, as it could even be your cable that's disconnecting the internet without you knowing. If you are happy with all that, then the next thing to check is make sure you have allowed Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War access to the internet through your firewall. To do this, all we need to do is open up our start menu and simply type in firewall. You now need to click on Windows Defender Firewall and you now need to click on allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall. We now need to scroll all the way down until we find Call of Duty and as you can see, Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War is ticked for private, which is absolutely fine. It means it does have access to the internet. If yours isn't on the list or it's not ticked, then go ahead and tick private and then try and launch Cold War again. If Cold War isn't on your list, then click on change settings and then click allow another app and then browse for Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. Once you have browsed for your game, go ahead and press add and then find it in this list and tick private. And now try and boot up the game and with a bit of luck, you will now be able to connect. Because if you don't allow it through the firewall, then it won't be allowed access to the internet. If you're still having issues trying to connect to Call of Duty, then the next thing to do is click on the link in the description below. And you will end up on a page that looks like this. This page is telling us if there are currently any problems with the online services for Call of Duty Cold War. Go ahead and select the game from the right hand side here and if we scroll down we can click on refresh and as you can see all the platforms are online which means there is an issue with my internet connection. So unfortunately the final step you can try is restarting your router. You may want to check out the manual for your router. I'm sure a quick Google will simply tell you the best way for restarting your router, but go ahead and restart your router and then try and connect to Black Ops Cold War. And most of the time, this will get you back onto the game. And that is it for this video. If you have a tip that will help other players getting back into Call of Duty, then please comment below, help everyone else out. And if this video did help you, hit the like button and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.